Real quick, I just wanted to say shout out to Aaron Coslow for bringing us a little goat. A little goat. It's got like goat cheese and stuff like that, but it's awesome. Hello world. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Today, I'm getting my hair cut. Right when I say it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood, it starts raining and there's a gust of wind. I'm not good at this weather stuff. I'm not going to be a news reporter for the weather. I should stick to YouTube. Gosh damn it, it's getting worse. I'm so freaking bad at this. Damn. What the hell? I just have to start my day and it starts raining. This is bull crap, Mother Nature! Bull crap! I'm done with you. I'm not done with you. We're just starting this vlog off for the day. We got at least 10 more minutes of fun filled action. But I'm about to drive, and that's not safe to vlog and drive. You know, I really wanted to get my haircut cut at this place. Like, I got a coupon for it, it's a free haircut. But I don't know big city traffic very well, and it scares me, so. Instead, I'm going to a fancier place. Walamarte. They are good at cutting your hair. Made it to Walmart, and I got the opportunity to park next to a beautiful Monte Carlo, just like mine. Like, that's just perf right there. Like, look at that. Mine's better, though. Mine's the Sea Bass Mobile. The sea bass mobile trumps all cars. I don't care if you have a GTR, a Lamborghini, a Ferrari. I got the sea bass mobile Mach 2. It's technically the second one, although I only drove the first one for a few days before I sold it and got this new one with a really crummy hood. But I'm gonna fix that. My dad and I are gonna work on that one weekend. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Hey there. But I finally made it to the Walamate. The Walamarte is the best in hair design, color, and cut. I'm gonna try to cross the road soon enough. Oh, I'm going for around this one. Gonna get a nice haircut, because right now this is looking pretty trashy. But, oh well. That's why I'm at the Walamarte. I just got out of the Walamarte, and I have gotten the best haircut I've ever had here. The Walamarte. Like, I had the best stylist ever, and I just told her I wanted it to look good. She trimmed it up, put this cool gel stuff in it, and just made it look sweet. And I love my hair right now. Like, I've never liked my hair. Especially the haircut I had before this. It looked flat and dull and dumb. And if I ever used gel, it just made my hair super shiny. But this, this looks good. I like this a lot. Like, I'm looking super fly right now. I don't know what I'm gonna go do now. Probably get some babes with the new cut. That's what it's all about, the babes. You know that phase that girls go through whenever they get their hair cut where we're hair colored or something and they just love it, it's the best ever. And then they begin to hate it. Well, it's starting to happen to me. I'm just not really used to seeing this much of my forehead. And now that I've got this haircut, I'm gonna have to get used to seeing a forehead there. I know it sounds weird, it's just something I'm not used to. And right now I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. But I'll get over it. It's still looking good. A lot better than what I had going on. The haircut I had before was crap. Sorry, there's something going on and I'm not really sure what it is with a lot of people. But, ooh, I think it's like the sorority thing. I'm not sure. Oh, they got cornhole. That's what they're doing. They're playing cornhole, and there's a huge mass of people. But I'm heading up there to the Rice Library, top floor, to get my hair cut. Or not to get my hair cut, to get some studying done. That's what I like about staying at college for the weekend, is it makes a really good opportunity to catch up, as well as get ahead on some of your homework. But, dang, there's quite a few people over there. I don't know what they're doing, can I? 
just zoom in a bit, can I? Oh no, can't zoom in. But I'm gonna go get some studying done and maybe get some footage from the top of the Rice Library. That's actually where I took yesterday's time wraps for the intro of the video, that window right up there that you can't see, but I can see. So let's see what we can get done today. I just finished up studying. I got some chemistry in, some intermediate online algebra, and so, oh, CIS, Computer Information Systems, Microsoft Word, it stinks, but you know, I gotta work hard, play hard, so I can keep vlogging like it's my job. That's why I do this stuff. Nah, don't tell my mom, but I'm going to college because it's my backup plan. If YouTube doesn't work out, then I've spent $40,000 on an education. So I'll be good. Nothing can stop me whenever I have a backup plan like that. But I don't even need that backup plan because I know this is going to work out. With fans like you, there's nothing I can't do. I'm hungry now though, so I'm going to go get some food. And most of the places on campus are closed, so I'm probably going to get some of the unhealthy stuff. But... You know, I've been eating good all week, so I think my train-like body will just plow through the bad food I'm going to eat, and then the grind will be back on, and Project Beefcake will resume. It's the way life works. Get beefy, and don't eat bad foods. Words of wisdom for the day. So I, um... Uh, it was really bad. I got some cheesy bread, some boneless Parmesan garlic tossed wings. But you know what? Hashtag no regrets. So it's about 12 o'clock at night right now, and I finally have figured out how to transfer the video from this nice quality camera onto my computer, convert it to a format, it's compatible with iTunes that can transfer to my iPad so that I can spend the next three hours editing it and get this video to you by 12 o'clock tomorrow. It has been exhausting. I've tried so many things. Emailing it wouldn't work because it was too big. The format wouldn't work for iTunes, but I found a converter. And by 3 o'clock, I might be able to go to sleep, but we're going to have a high quality video tomorrow. Everything's coming together with this YouTube channel. It's real rough, but I'm enjoying it, even though it's a learning experience, because I don't know how to edit or anything, and I just have to teach myself as I go. But it's all gonna work out in the end. So, ta-ta for now.